my uncle Shit. this week sent me this uh, article about Professor Kiara Bridges deserve her flowers right now. And this is from Ricky Smiley. Um, dot com. Okay. Mm -hmm. And it was uh, celebrating what she was uh, saying to, I don't know if he's a senator, but his name is Josh, uh, Josh Hawley. Mm -hmm. And um, like one person said, Kiara Bridges is not only a woman, but a black woman, schooled and obliterated Josh Hawley. Let me tell you, now my uncle didn't see what she was saying. Okay. But I'm going to show you what she was saying. Hold that joint close to your mic. So Mr. Chairman, thanks to all of the witnesses for being here. Uh, before, uh, I, I want to visit with you, Ms. Maskey, but before I do, I just want to clear one thing up. Professor Bridges, you said several times, you've used a phrase, I want to make sure I understand what you mean by it. You've referred to people with a capacity for pregnancy. It, would that be women? Many women, cis women, have the capacity for pregnancy. Many cis women do not have the capacity for pregnancy. Um, there are also trans men who are capable of pregnancy, as well as non-binary people who are capable of pregnancy. So this isn't really a women's rights issue. It's a, it's, we can it's recognize a that this impacts women while also recognizing that it impacts other groups. Those things are not mutually exclusive, Senator Hawley. Oh, so your view is, is that the core of this, this right then is about what? So um, I want to recognize that your line of questioning um, is transphobic, <laughs> um, and it opens up trans people to violence by not recognizing that. Wow, you're saying that wow. I'm opening up people to violence by asking whether or not women are the folks who can have pregnancies? So I'm one, I want to note that one out of five transgender uh, persons have attempted suicide. So I think it's important because of my line of questioning. Because so we can't talk about it. Because denying that trans people exist and pretending not to know that they exist. I'm is denying dangerous. that trans people exist by asking are you? you if you're talking are you? about women are you? having pregnancies. Do you believe that uh, men can get pregnant? No, I don't. No. Think <laughs> so you are denying that trans people exist. And you? that leads to violence. Is this how you run your classroom? Are students allowed to <laughs> question you, Absolutely. or are they also treated like this? Where no, you, no, no, they're, they're, told that to they're at opening up people to oh, violence. We have a good time in my class. You should join. I bet. You might learn a lot. Well, I, I would learn a lot. I've learned a lot. You, I know. This exchange. Absolutely. Extraordinary. That woman deserves her flowers. Yeah. For what? What did she do? She with looks stupid. Yeah. This is her clapping back again. Her filled with dignity and humanity. And that means your, being able your way to, of thinking that happens when more black babies are aborted. I believe, I trust, I love black people with the capacity for pregnancy. I think they have agency, they have okay. intelligence, they know what is best for themselves, and I would love to create the conditions under which they can live lives that are filled with dignity and humanity. And do you think a, do you think a, a baby that is delivered alive has value? Yes. Whoa. Do you think that a, uh, a a baby that is not yet born has value? I believe that a person with a capacity for pregnancy has value. They have intelligence. They have agency. They no, have I'm dignity. talking about the baby. And I'm talking about the person with a capacity and for I'm, pregnancy. And you're not answering the question. I'm asking. I'm, you I'm, answer, a, I'm answering a more interesting you think question that, to you me. Think that oh. a baby that is not yet born, let's say the day before this mother delivers, do you think that baby has value? I think that the person with the capacity for pregnancy has value and they have yeah. the they should have the ability to control what happens to their lives. Well, and, and yeah, she's, a, just no she's a professor at the question. I want to say Berkeley uh, Harl, University of Berkeley. She shouldn't be California celebrated Berkeley. in my opinion. What what why are they saying on the flip side, can you tell me why they're so saying they're saying we should celebrate them because loving the way uh at Berkeley law professor Kier Bridges is handling these questions from the, some of the Republican lawmakers during this hearing on the legal consequences of the Dobbs decision. That's the... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, reversal. Yeah, yeah, reversal. Yeah. She adequately suggested for Holly to take classes on homophobia. But, like, they are championing her because she stood up to some Republicans for the most part. Did she stand up to she them? Didn't. She, she didn't. She sounded crazy. Yeah. She didn't answer she any didn't. questions. She, she, uh, she deflected. And last time I checked, men can't get pregnant. And she, she, and, but and, she didn't even. She deflected the whole time. It sounded like she. You, you can lobby that she was threatening. Like, oh, yeah. matter of fact, your line of questioning ends up making me violent or making you know certain people violent. So, well, like, you, like, like, you want that? Do you want that kind of smoke or almost like? But yeah, these that was are the weird. people that shaping the minds of people in college universities now, man. They shaping the minds of the majority of America. She got a lot of love in the comment section, dog. Like, 
for this joint. You know what I'm saying? Maybe and there's some. I, I I guess I would need to see. I can't see it at all. Like that's them championing you are, her. That's because you are a sensible human being. But has, I want to hear the other side of this. Has a I, man I, I'm had, trying to. Has a man. Has, has, I didn't mean to cut you off. But I do want to know if a man has ever had a child before. Do we know that? There is a a, a, a man who who used to be a woman who is pregnant right that's now. That's not a man. That's, that's not a man. That's, that's not a man. Let's go back to what you were saying, Tiffany. Sorry. Definition. Yeah. But no, nah, I'm just telling you, like that's a cis <laughs> woman. That's a cis woman. That's a cis woman. Look that's not shit. a man. I want to talk about no. people who have ovaries. I don't want to see this. <laughs> We already just, know this. I just want to. I just the people I know that give birth have ovaries you know, and else. A, from, from my understanding, a uterus, and those are most those are people women. that are women. That's yeah. beside the point here for me. Okay. The point for me with this is, she couldn't even defend whatever it is that she was trying to defend. She had to deflect. deflect. And, and turn this into a woe is, hey, don't you, you pointing the finger at me? Instead of just saying, yes, no, this is what I support, this is why, based on what that was about. Right, she didn't she, make a point. She didn't make a point at all. It was just like, oh, you know what? You hate me. And it, you, you hate Francis. You, you, you hate, right. She, she hate played Francis. victim. She was not yeah. attacked. You, she you faked like Francis. she was attacked. Thank so you. So that's what Karen And then started attacking. So that's what they're trying to They're taking the book from Karen's mm-hmm. because that's what they do when and they the, feel And then when wrong. you attack back, then then they scream bloody murder. Yes. Because, she was, right. She was definitely doing a lot of gas like Yeah. And um, my six-year-old does it sometimes, too. Mm. If I'm asking him to clean his room or she, something, she he'll be like, true. you never want me to have fun. <laughs> Nope. You always want to ruin my life. Right, right. Yeah. Right. Because I want you to clean your room. That's Trying how help. that works. Dang, mm. that's kind of sad, man, because unfortunately, it's a lot of people that feel like whoever was in the comments, like, yes, good job. Good kudos job to for her. What, Even though? Somebody from RickySmiley.com wrote a piece giving her kudos, dog. That's what I'm saying. The thing is, the thing is about. And my stuff. uncle sent that joke to me. I'm sorry, because mm-hmm. you go. My uncle sent that joke to me, like, yeah, look at this. Because he ain't listen to the joke. After I sent him what she was saying, he was like, what, man, that woman bash shit crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what? That's the awful thing. Because if you don't do your research, you can mm-hmm. find yourself supporting something like you don't even matter. agree with. Yeah. What happened? You said T.D. Jakes and yeah. Potter's House? Oh, okay. <laughs> that's what I said. That's what I said. Sorry. Yeah, that's what I said. That's what I said. That's what uh, it sounded like. I'm yeah, not sure. Nah, man. Typically, those comment sections are going to be filled with the people who support her are going to be pro her. The people who don't support her are going to be anti her. There's a small group of people who listen to, honestly, who listen to that unbiasedly and are going to have, like, it's going to be influenced, but it's a very small group of people. I just, you know what it is? As a woman, right? It's so disrespectful. I, I'm a little offended it's that so we as women can't be offended. It's so by these stuff. people who just want to say I'm a woman all of a sudden. If you're I, know, offended, I know, then I know, you're homophobic. Right. But you know what's even more transphobic. I go, I go know, through being what I'm born as a daily versus, and I can't even tell you what a woman is, but they can tell me that they're a woman. And then if, that's and then, my point. And then if I decide to come out as a woman or say I'm a woman, mm-hmm. you got just as much rights. I, I'm, I might win Woman of the Year award, which has happened over like, an actual woman. Over an actual woman who does this daily, and I'm still figuring it out. You gonna sit here and tell Bruce, me because you put on makeup and a wig that you are a woman? A man is better at being a woman than a damn woman. Hold on, and you know who else quality. should be offended? Um, what the people that be modeling? Models? What are the ones? <laughs> <laughs> no, I was. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't know. wrong. I don't know. I don't you know, know the people that be modeling, they Touché. walk the, they walk the runway all the fucking time. Uh, oh, oh, that model. Drag, drag, drag queens. Oh, okay. Uh, drag okay. queens should be offended. Why so? Because you got women out here. Well, you have people saying that they are women mm-hmm. and they dressing up. They stealing drag queens' whole swag, swag. and they getting glory for something that's. Up in there. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> I just feel a way about it. It's a weird society, dog. A I feel very, a way about it. And just... as women, we should march. They, 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 they're taking away things that are precious to us and trying to tell us what they feel like it is 
and they haven't lived it. They got to the age 27, 15, and decided they were something. Oh, oh, I haven't oh, had Or like the, health, uh, the, the head of the health services or whatever. That nigga like 50-something or 60. Right. And he a woman now all I'm of a gonna sudden. Just, I'm going to just say this. Sure is. We should go to the prisons and let them decide if they're innocent or guilty. I mean, no, why not? It's the same thing. Oh, right? That's what you're saying. The determination here right. has nothing to Yo, do. It's not based I in reality. I found myself not guilty. Why? <laughs> why, are, why, why, why are facts so important in one realm of society, but in another, they're not? I, that, that 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 baffles me. Like, well, hold on. Just to push back here. Oh, okay. okay. Technically, it is the same, and they're going through the same process. Ultimately. Whether that person is deemed guilty or, or innocent, not. so they is, are on is, trial. Is determined in the law in the court trial, right? And you have to make a argue, a strong case for or against. And so, on the flip side, there are cases out here right now going on. I assume I don't know. That's about whether or not if I say I'm a woman, I am a woman. I like and it. what's what the result and of those cases are going to dictate. Whether or not I can say I'm a woman. You're talking about like the, the facts they're trying to. Yeah. But it's not. Really a lot of stuff isn't. A lot. Well, what's supposed to happen, I thought, in the court of law is more of like fact, matter of fact, not opinion. I don't a, know. People's opinion of what. Beyond a reasonable <laughs> doubt. Excuse me. Beyond a reason of doubt. Right. Or, like of what should happen. I thought. I could be wrong. I'm not a lawyer. You know who would be able to tell us right now? Who was just on jury duty? My wife. Uh, she was just a jury duty. Yeah, she was, she's, she's in not New York here. Right now. So allow me to play devil's advocate. Go away. Okay, because this group of people obviously has gone through some sort of trauma, some sort of uh, something that has upset that community. And I think everybody deserves to be treated. Everybody deserves to be happy or have a path to happiness, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. I just think. Going about it, they're going about it the wrong way in terms of attacking other people or attacking other beliefs, like pushing other beliefs down to raise to allow theirs to raise. There, there can be a place where both of them coexist. Is my point. Oh, Regardless yeah. of what you believe or don't believe, that's because it was done to them. So they're kind of fighting fire with fire, and that's what yeah. you it know. was done to them. Well, very, typically, people that do that don't really have. A concrete thing to stand, to on. stand on. So that's why they do that. Right, mm -hmm. right. Because if so, then that's the evidence true. would be able to present itself, right? They wouldn't have to true. throw smoke screens and do whatever else, right? Yeah. Your Honor, <coughs> right. make your trip. Right, right. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. right. Yeah. I mean, it's, 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 it's become a thing of civil rights. It went from that to, I don't even know what this Man, is now. Civil rights was a big ass <clears throat> Trojan horse. Facts. Like, I didn't even know Not at, at first. The time. They saw the horse no, and they were like, But I'm just like, saying, oh. I still feel like everybody deserves civil rights. Mm -hmm. Whether you're black, blue, green, you, you, like uh, you're gay, like you're trans, you whatever it is. Now. Shit. Every <laughs> human deserves <laughs> civil <laughs> rights. But once we start talking about stuff that just is not the case. Right. I'm not a woman. I'm not a woman. There's no way right. I will ever be a woman. No. Now we're getting into something else outside of civil rights. Right. That's my issue. I'm yeah, like, man, but, what is this? So you gotta understand. Every time you see a, a, a alphabet flag, you always see a Black Lives Matter flag right beside it. I mean, we know what it you is. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So they always utilize, <clears throat> um, I guess, Black people there's who others fight advocates, for right. justice or whatever the case may be. Well, because they know that there's white guilt, so that's the easier way to get what they want. Yeah, and then they want that energy from us. They're like, yeah, you see how they used to treat y'all? Now they doing that shit they to want us. us to support too. And they want us to support. And we do. And that has, that like some spirit. idiots. Just like that, every time. Just like that lady just right there. Who's supporting her now? <laughs> Is she a woman? Uh, Man, she's a cis. She's probably a cis woman. I'm what sorry, does that mean? I don't know what that is. I don't is. know what it means. I mean, I think it's you oh, born as a woman. She said it like, like this is what it. she is. So, I knew so what she was. Have, like, no, that's what she was saying, though. Can we just say what they're born as and what they are now? Can we just do that? Sis means you are born we as a woman. I don't care what it means. Can we just, because nobody knows what that means. You 
we Can born. we just say what you were born as and what you identify as now? No. You're being homophobic. Man. I don't think I am. <laughs> I think I'm being... No, I'm serious. Potter House. No. <laughs> <laughs> How am I doing that? Potter's house? What are you talking about? <laughs> no, seriously, though. By, by trying to figure out how you want to be identified? Because you won't let me give myself a title. Man. That I, does not really I, apply to I'm me. I'm the president of the United States. <laughs> okay, three-spirited penguin. Whatever. Okay, well, right. be, I did, okay, so it's homophobic to ask what... We're you're being right. homophobic right now because you're yeah. being combative. Hey, I gave you my pronouns. <laughs> Use those or else. <laughs> Use those or else. You know what's so crazy? Like I don't want to put uh, my wife's family business out there, oh. but my wife. But I'm gonna do aunt, it anyway. <laughs> my wife's aunt. She had schizophrenia. She was diagnosed oh, with okay. schizophrenia. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. And she, mental health. We went to everything. visit her in a mental hospital, mm-hmm. and it was Fourth of July. So it was the United States flags all over the place. Mm-hmm. Right. And her story was she's the president of the United States of America. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay. You understand? She was yeah. like, yeah, you see all these flags around here and, you know, all the red, white, and blue. That's because of me. You know okay. what I'm saying? Now, me being in my right mind, you know, I'm like, all right, you know, I know your mental state. Mm-hmm. I'm not going to correct you. Right, I'm gonna right, let you right. Have this. I'm, gonna let you, I'm gonna let you have your your win. Right. She's like, yeah, the Secret Service outside, all that. I mean, she oh, was going all oh, the way, okay. go all the way down the mm-hmm. rabbit hole, so mm-hmm. to speak. Yeah. And I let her have that W. Okay. But these people ain't in a damn insane asylum. Should and they do it. Should they be? So. At one that's point, where I wanted to go. <laughs> at that's one point, I, well, I don't. That's what. That's at one, no. At one point in time, it was classified as a mental. Disorder. It's, it's, for you it's, sitting here saying, should, you know, you know, to, forgive me for saying be, it should be because I'm not a part of the community. But what I'm just saying is, you know, I think some things should be supported, and I think some things should be you should you need support for, and other things should just be classified as what they are. I think like it's to okay accept to accept it. I was hoping it's okay to talk about it. I just don't want it to be. I just don't like it when violence comes into it. Meaning, like, no one should be ever bullied or no. hit or, you know, shot no. or whatever, no. beat up for, for who they or think who they, they are think they or, who they, or are. who they are. And no one should be blamed for someone else committing suicide either. If, if I'm keeping it real about that. Okay. Not, not one, <laughs> there's no one person that should be. There shouldn't be a generalization of no. blame. No. Mm mm. Hey, I Point wonder if it's person. like a. Uh, like let's say if it's a gay dude out there right now that's like, man, you you don't deserve to be considered a part of the LGBTQ because you think you're a woman. You know what I'm saying? Like oh someone, no, I have heard who, that. I've heard, right, 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 I've heard that there right, right, are some right. little, you yeah. know, tips oh, really? with that. Yeah, I but imagine it would be. They don't like it. Some I do know one specifically, a guy I know who did not like it when they dress. Like they cross dress. Oh, they feel like you know you should wear. You know, why be, you gotta, be, be, yeah, why you gotta wear a skirt and all that? And he's it's a gay guy. He doesn't understand why men need to wear dresses and dress up like women and stuff interesting. like that. On a less serious note, okay, I've never seen two studs together. <laughs> what does that mean? The way you said it. I know where he's I going with this. I thought he was going to go somewhere else with it. I know where he's going with this. Like, why, why, why? How come they don't like each other? Like, I mean, maybe it's, I don't know. Both of them is are too shit, manly. Is, is that shit gay? Is that shit Two studs yeah. is gay to them. Because Two one studs being like, together is gay to, to the studs. Because he yeah. looked like a dude. Yeah. She even looked though like dude. she looked like, she a, looked a, like dude. a dude. Even though she she's looked a like girl. A dude. Even though she's You're a still girl. not attracted to a girl. Yeah. yeah. Even though she really a girl. Yeah, you might as well be with a dude if you going if it's gonna be a stud with a stud. You might as well not be why with girls. Because studs look like dudes. No, they don't. Not when they're naked. <laughs> that was excellent. <laughs> you don't know. You don't know. You, you don't know. know. You don't know. Yeah. <laughs> so, all right. All right. See y'all through that line? You don't know. <laughs> Look, this, my, somebody sent me this video. I sent it to my uncle. Uh, this stud. Uh, that's a stud? That's a stud. But it's a woman. But it's a woman. But it's a woman. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, all right, whatever. 
<laughs> what is that? Right, 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 right. You got a tequila in here. <laughs> Let me show you something. I mean, uh, it is what it is, dog. Oh, I, they they make. They had a nice. She had a nice twerk. She's a woman. She, she can still nice be and twerk. do things that women do. That was a nice twerk. Yeah. Ooh, I mean, yeah. at best, she like at best, she should have an acting career. And she could pretend to be something else, you know, for a long period of time during her regular life. She might as well just go ahead and get some money for it. You know what I mean? Like, it's very easy. But, I mean, I guess my point is there's nothing wrong with being a woman and being manly. That's okay. Like, it's, okay. I, to me, there's nothing wrong with it. All right. But. There's no but. Oh, I say you say that no. to say what? I mean, some people like to, some women prefer to wear jeans rather than skirts. I think it might be something to do with the energy, too. Like it's a masculine energy, so two masculine energy. I was gonna say there's a difference between being a woman and being manly, like a manly woman and a stud. You know what I'm saying? A stud is is all the way. Yeah, we're talking like tomboy, not like well, yeah. Not I'm I'm speaking of something like a more like a tomboy, tomboy. but not Good. really right. Yeah, right, that's right, what right. I'm saying. Right, right, like right. a tomboy can can be Cross with over. guys. You yeah. know what I'm saying? A stud ain't gonna be with no dudes typically. Well, Unless that she dude, gotta get, she gotta get that. high and drunk or something. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? something. And be like, all right, fuck it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let me. And then I've seen some studs get pregnant that way. Yeah, studs that do is, be getting nah, pregnant. That is funny. I knew one, yo. <laughs> no studs do no, be I getting pregnant. I knew one. I knew one. I was like, what the hell? I was How the hell? Two for a second. I was like, women. I'm gonna she tell you like, something. Man, yeah. let me tell you something. I was drinking. <laughs> no, the say what you gonna say. <laughs> we got a lot I, of views. I, I think regardless of what a woman, I think a woman is always convertible. I always think that. Oh, okay. I and I think most that. men. I agree with that. I think oh, a woman that's just based that, that on the male and the female and like role. She can come back. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I say that all the time. Male and female yeah. role. Just based on what the male is and what the I female is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 Say it all the time. <laughs> 